So we're going to see how this works out. And Big Tonga going with the Fox. Had a night. In honor of Granny Smith, I want to say my favorite character is Meta Knight. <laughs> yeah, for me, right, for me, it's it, like once Lucario showed up in Brawl, but but then again, like back in the Brawl days, like back in the Brawl days, like I was, like my first choice was, was actually going to be Wolf, and then I moved on to Trainer, then I moved on to Pit. And then I made the switch to Lucario, and all of a sudden I was getting more wins than that, than than I expected to. Especially in those raw days where, like, we had to take on guys like, like SK92, Z, Lycan, like, you know, like, Lycan, Foe. This is what everybody was in their raw day. Like, like that was that was a brutal that was a brutal time. <laughs> But it was also happening. But it was also an extremely happening time there too, because because you know we all because we always got Reno Smash going. We had like we had Reno Smash hanging out with us half the time. We had I think we had Arizona Smash and, and SoCal, especially with their ball scene. The memories of days when, but. Yeah, like the biggest takeaway from the Brawl days was just the emergence of foe. Yeah. Oh yeah, Freddy. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, the emergence of foe and and good luck stopping SK9. Yeah, I know it was <laughs> nice. I did. I did. We streamed melee on on Wednesday last week. It was nice to see Kyle Lane. No, oh, yeah. That's good. Tonga be in a bad spot and again, not the way you want to give them to give any game, but Santa more than happy to take those. Switching up to the DK now. At this stage in the game, it's like we just gotta we gotta accept it. <laughs> like at this stage of the game, we gotta accept it. Uh, we gotta accept it and adapt to it. Like we still haven't adapted to it, and those that we expect to adapt to it are like, you know what, um, you know what, we'll just uh, hang back until Ultimate comes out. I can't can't say I blame them for that. And at the same time, I know. I know there are lots of people out there. Oh my good, and he tagged that. <laughs> well, that was, if he recovered from that, that would have been tech of the year. Oh my goodness. Oh, trying to look for the Dawn Percent, but not sure what the Dawn Percent's on Mewtwo, but oof, right. Up throw, looking, but the forward air, definitely going to take it. But you need DK to back up. Oof, just escaping, just escaping the Dawn. Can you escape it again? Oh, made a 50-50 and read it beautifully. He knew when he missed the first one, it's like, okay, it's, it's going to be a 50-50 from here. I just have to read the air dodge, and that's how he handled it. And, you know, back to, you know, but back to Bale, like, at this stage of the game, like, we're seeing, like, we're seeing the potential play out and play out and, and play out beautifully from guys like Salem and Mistake and and Lima. Like, hey, hey, that's them. Like, 
you can, like, I can't blame him for choosing the character. It's a character in the game. And that's what. And that's all. What, that's all it really comes down to. But, but the big thing is, like, we got to adapt. Well, game three in Battlefield. Oh, we for the long just escaping it, so especially with the rage that DK has. Yeah, at this point, back air should should fare very nicely for Big Tonga at this point. Careful with the shell balls. Oh, just escaping what would have been a killing up smash. Oh. Oh, tried to call out a roll with the down smash. Unfortunately, not going to happen. Dash attack to put a lot more pressure on Tonga now. Oh, giant punch, but not going to... Not <laughs> and a lovely back air, and that will do it. Big Tonga moving on. And that will do it for Xantha's tournament. And Tonga so far making quite a run right now.